Hello, welcome on your online program. In this video, I will teach you how to manage a stretching session. To do so, I will focus on several key points. There is a difference between stretching and softening. Both are absolutely okay. But as the goal is different, the way you will drive your session will be different too. For practitioners who need to stretch muscles, the objective is to reduce tensions and have a cool down time after training. For practitioners who need to soften muscles, the objective is to improve range of motion. Constriction. To create exercises on specific muscles, you need to reason from its insertions. One is the fixed point, the other is the mobile point. The goal is to pull these away from each other. Try also to stretch the antagonist muscle to balance the workout. Exercises need to be painless and need to be realized in the anatomic limits of each practitioner. You need to plan your exercises with logical transitions. You can practice being standing, lying down or sitting. Try to combine all the exercises according to their required starting position so that practitioners don't lose time and energy to stand up and to sit down for each new exercise. The methods. Two types of methods, passive and active. With passive methods, practitioners receive external help from another person or with material. It can also be help from gravity or auto manipulation. In this case, they are totally passive. It means they let themselves be stretched. This technique is highly recommended for the beginners who don't have proprioception. Two types of correction, proximity and distance correction. Proximity correction is usually for the beginners. Touch them to help them with a better posture. Distance correction is more verbal. Here we are. You have now all the keys in your hands to make a perfect stretching session. So let's start.